Hi, my name's Daddy, and I interview the number one player sometimes. Welcome, Richard, a.k.a. Mohammed. Hi, uh, hi Daddy. Hey. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. And thank you so much for agreeing to do the interview. Now, My pleasure. Richard, you're not only Mohammed Maher, you also operate another 3,600 cup account, right? Right. What, what is the um, name? Uh, my second account name uh, is Saad Haddad. First account I created. And uh, I have Mohammed Mahir. And uh, I have a small account still farming named Vizia. Oh, wow. You're a farmer as well. Yeah, I'm farmer. <laughs> Welcome to my world. Congratulations. <laughs> That's wonderful. <laughs> Thank you so much. Now, I will go someday to your clan <laughs> to get some uh, tips about farming also. <laughs> my, my friend, you're welcome anytime. Absolutely anytime. Thank you. Tell me about yourself. We'd love to know, you know where you live, how old you are. Uh, how did you find out about the game? Yeah, sure. Um, my name is Rich from Lebanon. I live in Dubai since 2006. And I'm 35 years old. Yeah, since I was young, uh, I have always been interested in strategy game. For, uh, first, I started playing like that alert, Age of Empire. Once I got an iPad, I started playing The Hobbit until I find out about Clash of Clans through a friend. And that was uh, in September 2012. Um, uh, I'm, I'm, I still remember the date because uh, it was one day or two days before, before or after my birthday. Uh, at first, uh, at first, like every beginner, I started training troops and do some attack. And when I have uh, any available resources, upgrade my defense. Then I found out it was sorry better for me to attack on resources than to get one or two star or win uh, the defense. I stayed clanless until reach uh, Town Hall 5. Uh, I never went to a global chat uh, and I didn't know that I can join a team uh, that can help me gain troops. I thought uh, clans were only for chat. Um, later on, my friend who told me about the game asked me which clan I am, I'm in uh, and uh, was informing me to give troops more than I take. That's when I found out that I was missing a lot. And uh, as soon as I uh, reached home, I requested to get in a clan. And it all started from there. I'm, I'm amazed you started off as a farmer. I have a big respect for <laughs> <Yeah>. you. <laughs> That's good. Yeah, and clanless. <laughs> and clanless is yeah, I was clanless, yeah. And, oh, you, uh, so you just realized that the clan is uh, at level four, uh, let's handle level four, right? You Level so, five, level five. Level five, yeah, that's okay. Yeah, I, I thought clan, the clan were only for chat. Uh, I didn't know that I can donate, take troops, give troops, uh, you know. and That's really interesting. So talk to, talk to us a little bit more about the farming. And, and what I'm really interested in is, is when did you start and why did you start uh, pushing for cups? I, start farming, uh, I started farming hard, upgrading my troops, my defense for about five months. Then I started chasing for trophies. Uh, I had the Town Hall 9. Mm -hmm. my, world were at, uh, yeah, my world were at level uh, 7 or so. I have few in uh, level 8. Queen uh, level 2, King level 4. But overall, they were okay to start my trophy push. It's great that you're a farmer. I'm still amazed. So, <laughs> so how about the trophy yeah. push? So what happened about the trophies then? I, I, I continued till 2,800 trophy. And then I wasn't able to progress since I was using giant archers, barbell breakers. At that time, uh, chairing replay wasn't available. And my teammates were all farming. I was 2,800. Uh, and all of them were around 1,400, 1,600. So I decided to move to another clan uh, uh, called Tokyo Clan. Mm -hmm. uh, someone attacked me from that clan. Uh, I like his attack. Uh, so I thought of joining his clan. And he was using Dragon. And I noticed that all top players were attacking with Dragon as well. You saw that he'd beaten you very well. And you thought, well, I, I would yeah, know how to yeah, do yeah, that. Yeah. <laughs> he beat me very well. <laughs> Uh, I saw, I, always, I was looking for top players, uh, camp especially, I saw Dragon there and it was hard maybe to, to start with Dragon, especially everyone need around 30 minutes to, to be trained and, and it was impossible to me. I had only one barracks that can trade Dragon, the other one maximum wizard. Was that the point when you started using gems? Yes, yes, exactly. When, when I start using Dragon, I start using at the same time gems. So Richard, that's really interesting. You, if you can't beat them... Join them. So, <laughs> so tell me about your journey to the Champions League. When I start pushing, uh, you know, my uh, I, I had Town Hall uh, level 7, as I said. I kept attacking 1,800s and I, uh, without using any games, I moved to Tokyo Clan. I got some hints on using Dragon and I targeted 3,000 trophies. 
uh, yeah, I put 3,000 trophies as the target. Mm -hmm. So I will be able to join Bomb Bombay Canada. So Bombay Canada was your, your target? Yeah, uh, yeah, Bombay was my target. But the issue I had, uh, yeah, the required trophy is 3,000 in Bombay. And a few days later, I reached 1,900 and a new update was available. Uh, they introduced uh, the league, Golem, uh, the force air defense, which made attack with Dragon much harder. So all players start using Golem uh, instead of Dragons. Uh, I kept attacking with Dragon um, since I'm used to them until I reached 3,000 trophies and I got accepted by Bombay Canada. Uh, at first, I was so happy to be accepted by, uh, by Bombay Canada. Uh, in this clan, uh, Cole, a player named Cole, uh, taught me how to use uh, Golem pick a wizard uh, combo. And from there, I hit the Champions League and all the way to the top 200 players in the world. You know, I, I remember when those when that change happened, when the dragons suddenly became impossible to use. Um, and it's amazing you, <laughs> you continue. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, in one night, everything changed. Uh, yeah. From uh, from you get anything from dragon, you do everything with dragon. To another yeah. part that you can do nothing with the dragon. You can do, but uh, most of them one star or uh, uh, dragon was in level three. Uh, level four wasn't available. Yeah, I remember. And I'm... we have another uh, also air defense. We used to spam some light uh, light spell uh, to move one air defense. Uh, two, it was okay to to manage, but uh, now we have four, and uh, it was uh, impossible. Yeah, it, now it's better. We have level four dragon. So tell me, uh, you know, for most of us, we we don't have very many gems. So is it possible to reach the Champions League without any gems? Yes, you can. You can hit Champions League now, especially now without uh, any any you without using any games. Especially old players who have been uh, farmed since a long time. And if your camp is uh, upgraded, keeping in mind that uh, hard camp it will make you win your defense. Well, you heard it here, guys. From the, the number one player in the world, you can reach Champions League without <laughs> gems. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they can. Uh, I think it's not impossible, but uh, they need to be passionate and. And work hard on it, and they will go. They will go there without losing any games. I think that's good advice. So, Richard, tell me, um, what are you seeing at your level? I mean, how long does it take you to find an attack at four thousand five hundred cup, cups? Mm, it take me. It take me around twenty minutes. Wow. Yeah, twenty minutes. It, uh, if I'm lucky, I can find the first match in like uh, ten to fifteen minutes. Oh my gosh, <laughs> that's a long yeah, time. Long, the, very uh, long time. The hourglass. For that, I create a Visia small account. Uh, so you can you can farm a little yeah. bit while you, uh, while you while you yeah you can have some fun from uh, I'm in small in uh, a small account in Town Hall uh, eight and uh, in a clan name uh, the Hitman. Do they know who you are? Uh, yes. yes, now they know. Before <laughs> I didn't tell anything. I'm sure. Uh, I wasn't top player anyway before. No, but I'm I sure. was in top ten, I think. When yeah. I uh, tell them that uh, Maher is my account and. Uh, uh, what did they think when you when you told them that? What did they say? Did they um, I, I don't remember actually, but, but I'm sure they didn't believe me. But <laughs> when I start bringing Maher in there, they till now some some of them maybe don't believe. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> you had to bring your main account there for them to believe you. That's, uh, that's uh, no, I go just to help some. Uh, and you know, I, I sometimes I'm bored or need to go out of the clan. Yeah. Uh, sometimes I use. Uh, sometimes I use Saad. Uh, I go to another clan uh, called While You Sleep. Yep. Uh, um, now, um, I have friends in there, especially old friends who was in my first clan. They moved to that clan. It's more active. It's too much active and very nice people. And uh, and leader is amazing. And oh. uh, I like to go there. Uh, it's moving a lot of tension and make me focus also. Well, there you go. While You Sleep, a great clan. You've heard it from the, the yeah. guy at the top. <laughs> yeah, it, it is a great clan, really. A great, great clan. Richard, tell me, we, we all lose sometimes, but the mark of a true champion yeah. is that it doesn't let sure. you, get you down. I mean, how, how do you feel when you lose and you know, how do you recover from that? Yeah, I know. It's not really a great feeling. Mm, <laughs> uh, that's why I don't log out uh, before I make sure that I got all my trophies back. Yeah, I keep attacking to, to get all my trophies back. Got it. So you, you don't give up, you carry on. No, no, I don't give up, no. Persistence no. and skill. <laughs> no. uh, I think all, all, all the champions are doing, all, all, all who is in Champions League uh, doing the same thing.
you know, when when the leagues first came in, you know, people were maybe what three thousand eight hundred, three thousand nine hundred. Now there's four thousand five hundred and thirty-two. Congratulations. <laughs> um, <laughs> Thank you. Is, is, should there be one champion league, or should there maybe be a champion one and a champion two? No, I think I think no need to to make in, uh, another league for the higher player above the eight hundred or four k or first because now we got around sixty player only in four thousand uh, trophy, uh, so still not enough uh, for four thousand uh, trophies player. No, I don't think so. Mm. Yeah, it's, it's still okay as it is. But thanks, Richard. I really appreciate that. So. Tell me, you know, you're at 4,532, you're only the second person over 4,500. It's absolutely amazing. Yes. I mean, how high can you guys go? I mean, are we looking at 4,600, 4,700, or maybe higher? Um, yeah, yeah. If, if the game going to more fun and uh, must have new members, and the cup surely will be growing up. If not, uh, no people play or less people play, uh, then it will be impossible. Got it. Okay, so you really need the people to come up from below you so that you have people to raid and then you can just increase sure. the yeah. sure, that will improve, uh, will make the game uh, sorry, the game level more higher. Are you going to carry on or are you going to stop? No, I'm carrying on. Mm -hmm. Well, I think if I got that high, I'd probably think, right, I'm going to go. <laughs> you know, that's, that's it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's it, exactly. Do you feel the number of gems, you know, the, the value that you're getting is, is correct? I mean, uh, you know, you know, Daddy. Uh, you know, this game takes a lot of game, and uh, it's so it's so expensive to play. I think if the game is more cheaper, we'll have more players. Uh, if cannot lower the price, uh, then uh, they can make like discount or mm. or some that to encourage yeah new people to come. Uh, uh, people who already retired come again, or or the available player now can more push or uh, more upgrade their. Uh, Defense, uh, make more attack mm. Mm. to be yeah. discount if they cannot lower the price. I understand. Yeah, or maybe they could offer a massive uh, chest for a, a discounted price. Yeah. 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 Okay, that makes a lot of sense. Thank you for that. Tell me about the Meher account. You know, how how come that you're using that one to get to the number one slot and not uh, side? Uh, I was playing Clash of Clans daily, but due to the load of uh, work, I decided to slow down. Mm -hmm. uh, I decided to slow down uh, on the game and I didn't have much time for it. Uh, since I have free time and I was uh, more active in the chat, uh, uh, later on Meher asked me as a favor to play for in his account and uh, improve his trophies. And when I started, I got excited about my improvement. And I, about my improve, I, I couldn't play and more and more and more. Okay. Got it. So then you, you just focused on the Maher account. Yeah, he, he had the Max account, you know, and uh, his wall was very nice. Yeah. Uh, this ha helped a lot to, to win in def uh, win defense and uh, get more extra trophies. So you focused on the Maher account and then, um, you know, just talk us through your route to the top. If you uh, yep. Uh, on my way to the top, uh, when I was around 3,900 trophies, Clayton, who is one of the top players, introduced me to Wilker. Uh, who did help me a lot uh, to get where I am now. Since Wilker lives in the States, uh, we took advantage of the time difference between us. So he helped me when I couldn't take care of the account at night and sometimes during the day, if I was busy in meetings at work or some stuff. Or... Okay, so you share accounts? Yeah, you can say that. Uh, Wilker is very nice and very, very... Yeah. Uh, he have a lot of experience and uh, a big player and... Uh, Actually, he teach me also uh, a new strategies, a new way to attack. Richard, I've got to ask, it's a bit of a sensitive question really, but I understand that um, all top players have help from others on their accounts. Uh, how about you? Uh, you know, Daddy, uh, it's impossible to play in this level without help. Uh, we need to have a relationship, we need, to have, uh, we need to go to the shops, and we need to work, and we need to sleep, so we need to travel. Uh, so at this level, uh, we have to have uh, help from uh, from our friends. Uh, so I have a friend called Wilker, uh, and I trust him, and he helped me. Um, he helped me to have a life. Mm, I can I can understand that. You know what? Yeah. We we got we got to you know the game cannot take over. You know you, you've got to sure you know, sure you have your life. You yeah. you cannot just stay twenty four hours. Yeah, it's hard up there. It's for, ch for the top level of champions, it's really, really hard at the moment. I understand that. Richard, tell me about when you're when you're searching for your 
you know, searching for a raid. You've waited for 30, yeah. 30 minutes, and along comes a friend, and then minus, you know, plus one cups. I mean, what's what's the decision yeah. you make there? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the coordination between the players is very, is very important. Uh, no matter the number of trophies they have, personally, uh, I, I have a secret code with my friend when they were, when they need to go to fence who are especially in range of uh, 500, 600 trophies below me. I find this guy for uh, plus one, uh, which I know if they, if because of our secret code, uh, I know if they need the 16 hour or 12 hour shield. Sometimes some player ask for uh, 16 hour shield instead of 12, so it doesn't expire while they are still sleeping. Uh, you know what? I didn't realize and, it was so well coordinated. <laughs> Yeah, and uh, you know, and minus one is nothing. Yeah, of course. If lower, someone lower from them uh, get one or two stars, they will lose around twenty or thirty trophies. So they'll be very happy to, you know, get yeah, a minus one. Very happy. Sixteen hours. <laughs> They're going to send you uh, a, I, some I, flowers. I was, I was at that range. At the, I was always praying to Tetua find me or uh, Clayton, Dreams, uh, <laughs> two pre any of our best friends or alliance or our teammates. Minus one is amazing for uh, when you go defense. Oh, I bet you're going to sleep sleep well knowing that you've not lost several hours of work. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. So, um, Richard. You know, I've got to ask the question, and I hate to ask it, but well, I'm sure you get asked this all the time. But, you know, 4,500 sure, Tell me. Uh, I hate to uh, I'll go on, and I'll ask anyway. How, how many gems do you use? <laughs> um, <laughs> you know, I don't know, season or day or whatever. I mean, how many gems? I mean, it must be a lot, right? Now? You mean now, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Um, now around, to, um, maybe in one week, I need only one chest. Wow. Oh, or a little bit more, you know, in that range, because I do only every day around maximum eight attack or 10 or 12, 15, seven, it depends. Ah. It's so hard to find matches, yeah. Ah, because you because it's so slow to find a match. You just yes, don't, exactly. You start using that much. So I suppose while you're searching, you're building troops as well. Right. Uh, people know at uh, range 3,200, 3,400, or uh, they will find a lot of matches. They will spend a lot of games. Wow, I wonder, and, if it's, uh, wonder if it's possible to farm at 4,500. <laughs> <laughs> you know, there's lots of dark elixir, right? <laughs> it's a very great idea because most of them put that uh, storage outside. Yeah, excellent. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, it's a very good idea. <laughs> can I use goblins? <laughs> yes, you can use goblins. <laughs> I think they'd probably die of laughter if they saw a goblin attack at that level. <laughs> oh, daddy, go away. Just leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <this is> funny. <laughs> yeah. uh, by the way, um, mm. uh, when I was farming, uh, I farming. I, I never use goblins. I always use the uh, barbarians and archers. I, I use goblins sometimes. I use them, yeah. But uh, I directly changed to barbarian and uh, archers. I got to ask you. You know, did you ever look at any any um, YouTube videos at all when you were farming? You know, any any particular YouTube video people that you remember? <laughs> yeah, I check your video actually. You're kidding. Yeah, really. Oh, I, I I watch a lot of them uh, attacking, uh, farming, and and some cute video like uh, attacking full population of wall breakers. <laughs> yeah, that, <laughs> was was a, like, that was a fun video. Watching and waiting, <laughs> <laughs> and your attack, uh, your famous attack about gal uh, b balloons and minions, because later on uh, top players start using the strategy. Wow, I, I did this one a long time ago, and uh, now the. <laughs> A top player use it to get uh, top one with balloons and minions. I'm humbled, to be honest with you, that the top player in the <laughs> game was a, was a video. Yeah, yeah. Watch my videos. <laughs> I'm sorry about that, if I made any mistakes. And, and before, the, the, before, before, it was like funny looking at them, ah, balloons and minions, okay. But uh, it really worked. Mm. Well, you know, I, I, I can talk about it, but it's people like you and people like other champions that actually do it. And um, I respect that a lot, you know. Talk is cheap. You are giving ideas, Lady. Oh gosh, I feel I'm embarrassed now. It's you because... create, you create, and people follow. I'm going red here. You know, I mean, if you can see me now, I'm red in the face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you. Uh, that's made a, an old man very happy. So, Richard, I don't know if you saw the video, but uh, maybe a couple of months ago, uh, Jonas, the developer, the Supercell developer, mentioned that yeah. Supercell is. You remember that, right? They were working on uh, Clan Wars. Um, they didn't say when it's coming out, but they said they're working. What would, I mean, you're in the number one clan in the game, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, what, right. What, is, what is your opinion about clan wars? 
Uh, I think I think it's gonna be a good idea. Uh, the reason is that it's going to refresh the game uh, for some players who maybe don't play so often. Yeah, they give us a sense of community is that we can work together to win and improve uh, teamwork within the clan. Uh, okay. So you know what? If I if I was a gambling man, I don't really gamble. But if I was a gambling man, I think there's gonna be, <laughs> there'll be two clans. There'll be two clans that I put money exactly. on. Exactly. One of them right. will be Sky, <laughs> and the other yeah. one <laughs> Why will, not? Be, will be Mega. <laughs> Why not? So, what will be what will be terrible is if Sky fights Mega. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when you get the power, you will do that. <laughs> yeah, that's right. We can farm. We can clan war farm you, and you can cup chase. Uh, you know, cup destroy us. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. That's excellent. Well, um, I've, I've got to ask. You know, I, I don't. Take every match that I'm offered. Do you do you skip or do you do you just attack? What, what's your uh, strategy? <laughs> Maher don't skip anything. <laughs> cool. uh, for Maher, twenty cup, ten cup, or one cup is the same. The only goal is, to, is the only goal. Uh, the only goal is to get uh, cups. Uh, be number one. So you you wait thirty minutes. You get an, an offer and you're gonna take it. So yeah, must... I never skip since maybe three thousand seven hundred. So your strategy is as golems, witch, wizards, and a few um, few wall breakers. And so you you must be able to take any base with that with that attack strategy. Anyone, right? any 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 base. So you, do you change your attack strategy? Uh, it depends of the camp. Yeah, uh, okay. it depends uh, where is their heroes, where is the C location, their inferno, everything. Oh. I choose the best uh, way to go and uh, reach the edge. You know, maybe I'm going down the wrong route with balloons and minions because I only take, uh, you know, I only take attacks with balloons and minions where there's egg crossbows are set to ground. So perhaps I should. <laughs> I'm terrible. <laughs> My golems and witches. I'm terrible. I should watch the videos that you're showing us <laughs> about your attacks because I'm going to learn. <laughs> okay. Thank you for sharing those. Yeah, well, welcome, Daddy. <laughs> it's good. Supercell is about to launch Boom Beach. We all know that, right? It's available in Canada. Yes, I heard about it. Are you going to be uh, the number one player in Boom Beach? Are you going to play, uh, are you going to play Boom like, Beach? Clash of Clans is enough for me, trust me. <laughs> of course. <laughs> I can, I yeah, can, it's more than enough. <laughs> Fair enough. You know, you, 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 I can't say I blame you, to be honest with you. Richard, on behalf of the community, I really want to say thank you for taking your time to do this interview. And, sure, um, Daddy. Thanks to you. It's really appreciated. Now, I, there must be somebody in the game that you'd like to thank, uh, maybe some clans or something. So, you know, who, who, would you, who would you like to say thank you to for, for helping you? First, thank you for you, Daddy, for this interview. And I would like to take uh, this opportunity to say a big, big, big thank you for clans like U8, King Landing, Made in Italy, Mega, uh, all the players of this clan uh, for their support. Indeed, they are great, great, great player, and without them, I wouldn't have made it to where I am now. We come for the gameplay and we stay for the people, right? Right. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, well, thank sure. You. Uh, to, to, teamwork is too much important. I agree. With you. So thank you, Richard, and thank you for watching and thank you for listening. Um, it's been a real pleasure making this, this interview. It's my pleasure. It's my pleasure, Zaghi. <laughs> Thanks uh, for your time and uh, your interesting to make interview with me. Excellent. It's my thank pleasure, you. really. Thank you. So um, we would love to hear your comments and your thoughts in the, in, you know, in, in the comments. Um, Richard, are you going to be reading the comments on the video, right? Yeah, sure. Of course. Excellent. Okay. So thank you very much for watching. Take care. Bye for now.